In this week's edition of Array of Hope, communities celebrate the success of some of their students. Pride and joy in Manchester and St. Elizabeth recently. Communities in those parishes celebrating students who performed well in their GSET exams and receiving placements at either Monroe College for the boys and for the girls Hampton High. But why does the success mean so much? Shade Dyde, who lives in Alligator Pond, Manchester, said it's especially delightful since our community is often stigmatized. My community is not really a good community, but we support all the time to make it very wonderful. My father worked so hard for me to go to school because I live off the sea. He go where he can't go to sea because of the bad current and the bad breeze. So I am so grateful. I am proud of her so much. I do everything just to make sure go to school and stand up as a father with her. It's a similar feeling for German Levy's mom, who live in Pepper Mountain Valley, St. Elizabeth. I struggle so much sending German to school. Sometimes I don't have it, but I still send him to school. And praise God, this is a result that come out for him. Celando Machabel is from Goshen, St. Elizabeth. His mother is elated. The father passed away eight years ago, and life has been very, very hard for me. But I try my best to send them to school and, you know, um, to tell them that education is the key. Chelsea Crump is also from Goshen. Her neighbor brags about her GSAT score of 92%. For the past couple of years, we haven't gotten a Hampton pass out of the district. I, and for Chelsea to come and get that pass now, the whole community is behind her. All when she come from school, she do her homework before she take off her school clothes. So I know that she would do very well. Sarita Waite is from Warminster, St. Elizabeth. Her grand and stepfathers believe she'll continue to make them proud. She clings to her book. Whenever time you find her, she has her, her book. A well-dedicated student, a well-groomed child, I must say. She really deserves this. They're hoping that the success of students from the communities will help to break the stigma. I am proud to say that good things can come out of Alligator Pond. So all we have to do is just support her. And a promise to uphold the standard. I'm going to go to school. Don't waste time taking my education and make mommy proud. With a ray of hope, I'm Kian Morgan.